Isn't it good to know that we are royalty? That we have a royal position because of Jesus Christ and what he did for us on the cross. You know, it says in 1 Peter that we are a holy nation. We are a royal priesthood. We were not a people, but Jesus made us God's children. And so we sit in Ephesians chapter 1, it says that we sit in heavenly places with Christ Jesus. We rule and reign in this life by one Christ Jesus. You know, it also says that we're a peculiar people, that we should give the Lord praise, that we should magnify Him and put Him first in our lives. This royal position gives you authority. You know, when the prodigal son came home um, after he was in the pig pen, he was eating what the pigs were eating, and he said, I'm going, he came to himself. And many of God's children need to come to themselves and find out who they are. They are not beggars. They are not, they are adopted in, they are engrafted into the family of God. That we are God's own. And he loves us and he has set us in heavenly places uh, in Christ Jesus, we are there. We are there with authority. We are there with the rulership. Remember when the prodigal son came home, that he had uh, a ring was put on his finger, which meant authority. A robe was put on his back. Uh, that robe of righteousness is on us, and we are God's own, and we need to be operating in that royal position of authority and power uh, with our Father, with our brother Jesus, and with the Holy Spirit. You know, that Holy Spirit gives us that power to operate in that royal position. And so let's take our rightful authority in this earth, bring down strongholds, bring down the strong men, in Jesus' name, thank you for watching.